Are we live? Are we live? I think we're live. Yes, YouTube says we're live. All right, cool. Yeah, I got my uh, my silver play button. As Harry Potter says it's mine. It's right here. And it says it weighs three pounds. It's a little heavier than I thought, than I was expecting. <clears throat> but I got this yesterday in the mail. And I posted a little video about that, just me picking it up. And I've held on to it this whole time. And I've not broken any of the seams. And I've got the my address blurted out. So all you weirdo stalkers, don't do your stalkery things to me. Because it's weird. I never understand the stalker people. But yeah. Uh, Rise Rangers. Hello, congratulations. Ahmad Diab. Hi. Call that Carmen. Cayman, Carmen, 04, hello, hello. Small Kitten Bell, how is the boy? Which one? They're all great. All my kids are doing good. So anyway, yeah, I've got my... You're supposed to get these at 100,000. And me being naive and like kind of dumb, I just assumed YouTube, when I rolled over 100,000 subs, that they were just gonna like mail it to me. I didn't realize you had to like go in there and click some things and put in codes and... I should have got this about two and a half years ago because I'm, I think I just rolled over 336,000 subs. So anyway, I've got this here and I've got my little my hatchet. I opened it up with my hatchet. This is what I carry with me in my morning walks for taking care of stray dogs and stalkers. And so I'm gonna open this sucker up because I wanna see what it looks like. I don't think anybody's ever opened one of these with a hatchet before. Oh, Miss Mary, thank God you're here. I don't, I haven't even really checked. I'm not sure if we have, if I've got any super trolls yet, but for the people, the new people, Miss Mary is one of my uh, Whomping Willows, also known as um, a uh, moderator. So if you get out of line and start asking ridiculous questions and harassing me, she's going to do just like the Whomping Willow in Harry Potter and go whack! And Dwayne over DSD at the Dad Surviving Divorce, he's another one of my moderators, thankfully. And um, Becca, watch out for Becca because she'll get you too. Anyway, here it goes. Da -da -da -da. Corny dad music. I don't know what. What do y'all see? Anything? No, just a black thing here. Okay. This is a letter from Susan Wojcicki, CEO of YouTube. Ooh, she sent me one of her cards. Congratulations on your subscriber milestone. We are honored to take part in recognizing your achievement and want you, your experience to be exceptional. This award was inspected by and packaged with great care by Rick. If your award is damaged during shipping, please contact us, blah, blah, blah. Well, Rick, so far so good. Cool! fingers from being a mechanic and showed up presented to Caleb Leverett for passing 100,000 subscribers on YouTube. Say cheese! Yay! I got it! I finally got it! I'm so happy and so excited. It's... Hey! It looks kind of dented. Can y'all see that? Can y'all see that? Look at that. It's dented. What the hell? Oh, the box is dented. I'm glad I'm doing this live. Look at there. See that? Yep. Right there. No, Rick, you probably done good. It was probably, we'll just blame it on UPS. Rick did good packaging it, I'm sure. Everything else looks fine, but... Oh, well, I'm kind of dented myself. I may not even say anything about it. 
I'm just kind of excited to get it. It's got a little nice little hangers back here. Just more junk to carry around and pass on to the kids so they can later throw in the junk because they probably don't care once I'm dead. Anyway, how is everybody? Everybody doing well? How's your Friday going? Oh my goodness. The kids came over, Blaine and Hayden did anyways, uh, came over, or what, not yesterday, but yes, the day before and the day before that, and we had a Harry Potter marathon. And that was really cool because the boys hadn't seen it all. And Blaine fell asleep for some of it towards the end, but Hayden, well, he's a total trooper, and stayed up for the whole thing. Okay, that's messed up. Came in the box. Whoa, 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 hang on. Still a great job. Congrats from Nike Hikey. Thank you very much. How are you doing? I'm doing well. Harry Potter. Do, 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 do. One punch. I'm glad. I'm up late for this, by the way. I'm from England. Humongous. Got a lot of people from England that tune in. I think it's really cool. Man, we got like 94 people here. That usually Fridays aren't very, aren't very, uh, very popular times. But anyway, yes. Some of the complaints I've got is you cannot hear me. They're saying, Caleb, speak up. We can't hear you. I know. I'm still recording this from my phone. Um, here shortly, I'm going to be getting a new computer with headphones and a microphone but for now all i have is this i'm planning on doing an upgrade upgrade with a double d for his double dope of his pin bean any uh idiocracy fans out there <laughs> i love idiocracy but yeah if you're just tuning in look what i just got i got a dented silver play button and Oh, look, it even reflects. You can see yourselves. What kind of a cosmic... Oh, my goodness, what are we going to get into? Deep down the rabbit hole. <whistles> I'm such a dork. But anyway, yeah, there's my plaque. It's, it's nice. It's very shiny. They said it weighs about three pounds. I guess they're about right. Now, here's to getting my... Uh, gold play button. Hopefully I can get a gold. I'm up to 330 something thousand, so I'm about a third of the way there. And I guess I'm going to just take some of your comments. Congrats, uh, the Foxy Pal. Congrats, which Harry Potter movie is your favorite? I like Goblet of Fire and Deathly Hallows Part 2. I'm about right there with you. I love Deathly Hallows. Um, I love Goblet of Fire, but I like the Deathly Hallows because Basically, it just like I've said before, it it brings everything full circle. If you didn't watch, that's what I told the boys in the beginning when we started. I said the first one, boys. I'm not gonna lie, it's kind of corny. It really is. It's good. It's great. Not shit talking, but it's kind of corny. But uh, you have to see the first one, or else you don't. You won't understand everything else. How long did it take you to get to after how, how the that guy Kevin? How long did it take you to get it after you hit a hundred thousand? Well, like I said, um, I hit a hundred thousand like two and a half years ago. I just assumed that they were going to just instantly ship it to me. That's my ignorance. I had to get online and get some kind of code and enter the code. And about a week, week and a half ago, so once I actually did the proper steps like they tell me to um what in the hell i swear to god i'm gonna have to get a new number um anyway ah uh, gee many christmas people i know it just cut out i swear i flicked it up i pushed the little moon button and somehow the calls keep coming through oh it drives me bonkers Two more weeks, two more weeks, and I'm going to have a laptop where I can just turn my phone off and leave it in there. Uh, Ahmed Deb, why are your comments turned off in your videos? That is a very good question. I'm happy to answer that one, even though I answered it several times. I did not turn off my comments, just like I did not turn off the comments like you're commenting now, hence the reason I'm seeing your comments. YouTube turned them off. I do have a contact with YouTube. I've simply not been able to 
actually I've just been lazy. I do have a contact and I'm going to be working with them. If you notice, a video made back in May still has the comment sections up. No idea why. Uh, there's one where I'm protesting in front of the next hospital. Those comments are still up. Um, there's two or three more, but all the rest of them, they just arbitrarily took them off because of that Momo thing that happened uh, about two, two and a half years ago. Uh, Timothy Gutsman, damn it, that was my question. Oops, I'm not sure which one that was. Caleb didn't make, it's a limited edition. Caleb, the D Dent? Oh, the Dent, yeah, the Dent, D-E-N-T. Ooh, Miss Mary's clobbering some people. Hi, I love your channel. Taitlin Howe, thank you very much. Is your vid on kid friendly? Uh, no. No, it has nothing to do with that. Uh, Colin Klein, hi. Demon Q, hi. Yeah, thank you, Miss Mary. Yeah, let's don't talk politics because politics just drives us apart. And I, for one, have an opinion, but I get tired of beating my head against uh, the wall because nothing is going to change, especially on this little podcast. Cohen Kine, it's my birthday. Well, happy birthday, Cohen. Any videos with the children? We usually have, yeah. We usually, it usually just cuts them off. But I don't have my kids. Even if I did have my kids, they're all adults now, or most of them. We don't need politics, y'all. Yeah, it's it's boring. It's nothing. Nothing is going to change. I'm, I'm like I said. I have. I still have my same opinion. You have a PO box that a friend who wants to send you something. Not anymore. I've had them in the past, and some of my old videos have my PO old PO box, but I don't have access to them anymore. So no. I'll. I need to get one. I know I do. I just haven't. But thank you. Okay, Epic M147. Hi, I just joined this channel, and can I get a shout out for one of my YouTube? As long as you're not trying to trick me into saying a wordy dirt that will get me demonetized, go right ahead. Yep. All right, Dwayne. He's out there whomping, willing. He's smashing some some idiots. I think they're going to get by. You're not going to get by them. One person so far has gotten by and actually tricked me and Hayden caught it last time when he popped in um, hey man tell Parker I said I love your Parker series okay thank you Seth Shumate Shumate I'm not sure you say that Miss Mary's smashing some more smashing some more I'm doing well uh, Question, what is your goal in subscribers and do you think you will ever end this channel? Uh, that's from, oh, dadgummit. There we go. Z oh, I'm not even, not, I'll never pronounce this word. Zilye, X-I-L-Y-I-E. What are my goals for, my, uh, my goals for the channel is, I hope that my channel, I've said this before, I hope that my channel is, Someday, sooner the better, irrelevant. It's put in a museum. Things that weird people in the family court used to do because the family court was so bad. My hopes, I don't see it happening in my lifetime. I hope it will, but I don't see it happening in my lifetime. The family courts change and Title Four d gets... And like, I'm going to take my axe, my hatchet, to Title Four d whenever... When, when the family court is truly reformed and it genuinely is about the best interests of the children instead of about the best interests of the politicians lying their fucking pockets with our money and using our kids as bait, then I'll be happy to get off the air and never have to eat any, any more. Like I said, just turn my channel into a museum. Things that we used to have to do to get our point across because the crooks in the family court won't pay attention. Uh, Kira Lanky, thanks for asking, but I'm not talking about that. I've talked about that till I'm blue in the face. Everything there is to know about my children is already public knowledge on other videos, and if I haven't said it, it ain't getting said. Uh, Octaviani, congratulations, thank you. Uh, yes, Lee, the admins are very busy. They have to be, because there's like super trolls that, that just, I don't get it. I don't understand why. It's not like I'm PewDiePie. 
Uh, George Hargreaves, I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. Hi, Caleb. How's it going? And the Inoe Noe man, all the way from Scotland, from K and N. I'm doing well. I cannot wait to visit Scotland. It's my birthday, and I'm 13. Oh, baby Al Alivis with Rosemary. Well, happy birthday. Yes, y'all trolls, and not necessarily trolls, people just asking that same question. Pay attention to what Miss Mary is posting. And if Becca was here, she'd be doing the same. Oh, for fuck's sake. It drives me bonkers. I know, it just cut out. I know, I know, I know. I've got the little moon button pushed, and somehow they get by, and they keep calling, and it interrupts, and that's why I've got to get... Oh, new computer. I have a laptop. Like I've, I've, I've got a laptop. I've got a Mac here, but it's just so old. And it's, it's so the, the memory's so full. It doesn't. It's it's just too old. It just it won't do the job. But these people just keep calling me, and I've even got it on mute, and they're not supposed to be able to get through, and I don't understand why they're how they're getting through. Uh, Tanner FM. I'm a big fan. Thank you. I'm farting in my pants right now. Steven, that sounds like a personal problem. Thank you, dear Steve. Yes, always. Caleb, you got a Patreon? You could really use one. As a matter of fact, I do have a Patreon. I've not promoted it much lately. I think I've got a link to it on my Instagram account. Uh, my family are going through some troubles now, and I just wished it could be over from human. Yeah, I know the feeling, man. Uh, Caleb, you can buy a gold play button. Well, what's the point in cheating? <gasps> there she is. Hi, Miss Becca. Mary and Dwayne are having a whopping will of so much. Now you you can give them a little thing. Go take a pee break. Uh, Caleb, you should visit. Are you trying to trick me to say something? Victorian. Okay, no, probably not. I don't know how to say that, so I'm just going to take your word for it, George Hargreaves. I should visit something called Oh, Clithero? Um, is Crank My Cat Your Old Business? Yes, it is. I started that back in 2007 when I got divorced. Back then, Trick My Truck and Pimp My Ride were big TV shows, and I just thought I was so clever being a caterpillar diesel engine mechanic. I'll just say, hmm, what about crank my cat? Or, or, or. Oh, yeah. Still got my Oh My Gaia shirt on. I talked to Wendy. She said, y'all have made a few orders. Uh, so if you would like to experiment with a new kind of deodorant that I wear, this is the leather scent that I use. Oh, my guy. My buddy Wendy in northern Idaho is a small business owner and she makes this and the link to it happens I did remember that I'll put that in the description box oh my Gaia.com uh, hello legend you're so epic am I e Ewan Bon Bonaro Bonner Bonner 07 Parker is the homeboy hello well done, thank you. To the moderators, yes. A very big thank you to the moderators. Uh, what happened to my old business? I, I, <laughs> I went to the divorce court and got divorced. and uh, I just I quit using it. I kept a Gmail account, which is, that's my email. My crankbycat at gmail.com. Uh, where did you get the sign in the back? I talked about that a couple of lives ago. Um, I don't remember not having the yield sign, and the stop sign was off to the side. It was mangled on a field job I did probably 10, 15 years ago, and I kept going back to that same rig, and it kept getting, the pole get, kept getting more and more mangled, and it was getting shoved off to the side. It's going in the junk anyway, so I just went ahead and took the screws off and tossed it in my truck, and now I've been lugging it around ever since. Okay, did you say you weren't going to talk about BLM? I'm lost. Uh, I don't particularly want to talk about BLM as far as Black Lives Mattering. I think it's obviously very important. 
but much like my channel and my comment section, it gets trolled and it gets overtaken by people planting false flags. I think it's a real shame what's happened to it by the trolls that have taken advantage of it, but that's kind of one of those things. If we're only talking about the genuine movement itself, I'm happy to talk about that, but it gets, it's so overtaken it and taken in the wrong context, it gets political and politi politics drives people apart. And what I want to do is bring us together because the more we're together, the more we can shove it to the man particularly Ken Paxton, and the more we're split and divided, the weaker we are, and they pick us off that way. That's how they do it. Do you like video games? Um, nah, not really. I appreciate them. I know I've got a lot of gamers on here. My kids are huge gamers, and Hayden's like a big COD, Call of Duty guy, like gigantic Call of Duty. He's like one of the ringleaders in his circle of friends. Um, hello from Wisconsin, Juanita Fields. Well, hello, Juanita. Miss Mary, thank you. I just tuned in. I apologize. Hey, it, the moderators know that people make mistakes. They sometimes, be, yeah, people are curious. They have questions. Hey, how are the kids? I know people are no, and it's okay to ask. You just doesn't know, but I'm just not going to talk about my kids anymore that's already been out. Oh my God, now talks about signs. DC, are you trolling me? Your volume is low. Can you turn it up, please? I wished I could. It's all the way up. But it's a phone, and this is all I've got until YouTube gets me my next check. I can go get some more equipment. I guess I could yell. Congrats from the Netherlands, Bosca Bowder. Thanks, man. I appreciate that. If you're just joining us, Caleb Leverett just got his very own silver play button. Now I've got to figure out how to do the silver play button from the, you know, like where y'all click on my actual site. I can get the, I don't know, I have no idea how that works. Okay, Caleb, where are you? Is that a trailer house? I'm confused. From Doom Postal. Yes, it is a single wide trailer house in the BFE of Conroe, Texas, where I'm renting it. I just moved. Hey, congrats, man. I saw your first video from Parker 2013, and I've been following you along since. Well, thank you, Cheesy Raccoon. Congratulations. Wait, crank. Hey, can you say hi back, please, from John Tay Brooks? Hello, John Tay Brooks. Congrats again from Sasha. Well, thank you. Cool, congrats from Wanda997. Miss Mary, I completely respect his decision on that. I do not blame him for that at all. Well, thank you very much. I'm glad y'all see it my way. And JC, nice to see you back. How does it feel that your video got so much views, LOL? It, I, I think it's cool. I think it's great that people are relating to it. Because family court problems are one of those things that a lot of people that are going through it do not like to talk about. Because it can be embarrassing. It can be humiliating. When you go broke like I did, it, it, to a lot of people, they're like, they're, it's, it's shame. it brings shame. And... And like I've said, particularly when good mothers get their kids ripped away, uh, it's particularly hard on them because society views, oh, what did you do? You must be a bad mom. And nobody wants to be known as a bad mom or a bad dad. But uh, as far as the the video, uh, yeah, it is what it is. I'm, I'm glad that people are relating to it and starting to talk about it more because that's the only way anything in, this, in the, the family court's ever going to change is when we start standing up to these assholes. Um, what's your go-to McDonald's order? <laughs> I go away from McDonald's. No offense, I just don't like, just don't eat McDonald's. I'm too old. My gut's grown in too, too fast as is. I don't need any help. Hi, Caleb. Greetings from Germany. Stay strong and keep your head up. You and your kids can and will do it from O Music 93 Well, thank you, O Music 93 What can we all do to change things in family court? Ty 
food? That's a really good question. I don't have an answer to that. The only thing I know that ever worked for me personally is activism. Making it very obvious, this isn't right. Pull out your camera, put it in the faces of people that are messing with your kids and just record them. I don't know what else to do. I used to be against, and I'll, I'm not, without getting too far into politics, I used to be against calling your representative and getting a change. Maybe that's the only way short of doing something that I can't talk about. Uh, but the more people talk about it, the, that's the only way I, I see anything ever changing. The, the, just for instance, in Parker versus the Man, where he engages in civil disobedience, and I recorded him sitting down in the parking lot. That was in Ector County, Texas in 2013. Since that happened, and shortly after that happened, I don't know if what we did was a catalyst, but I'm sure it was it had a little bit to do with it because I was pointing a spotlight on how rotten a decision that asshole Judge uh, Whalen was in taking Parker away from me. After that happened, Governor Greg Abbott appointed a, an entire new judge judgeship, an entire new court, and appointed Judge Sarah Kate Billingsley to that court, where she is the only per well, maybe not the only. All she sees is family court issues. She doesn't see criminal, nothing like that. All she sees is family court is, uh, issues and court cases. So. Maybe we had something to do with that. I'd like to think it, it helped. Do you plan on reviewing more TV shows and or movies for your podcast from the Foxy Pal? Actually, yes. And I'm glad you brought that up because another one of my favorite shows dropped season five on August 21st. And it's called Lucifer on Netflix season five. And yes, I'm going to be all over it like stink on shit. I absolutely love the character of Lucifer. Do you accept Super Chat donations? I do. This is now my career. This is what I do from Cheesy Raccoon. So I've got the... I've never been on YouTube from your perspective, your point of view. I don't know what it looks like. But yes, I'm, people have done the Super Chat uh, donations or what thing. Or you can become a, a member. That'd be cool too. Can you give me a shout out? It's pronounced, uh, I'm not falling for that. And you might be doing me genuine, I'm not sure. I'm not gonna bother reading it because the last time someone tried to trick me into saying a wordy dirt. Uh, do you wish to have a GoPro in your future? I actually have a GoPro, uh, Nike Hikey. If you watched the Parker movie, whenever Officer uh, Rocha is starting to come around, and I'm having a, you hear this noise, just that's me actually taking my GoPro off, the little suction cup off my window. I had just gotten it and I didn't even know how to operate it. Hell, now that I think about it, I've never used it since. I might have a whole new camera angle of that entire, I've got to go look. I'll be right back. It's like right in here. Be right back. Hang on, y'all. Be right back. I totally forgot about that. Yep, here's my GoPro Hero 3. In the original Parker movie, you don't see this, but you hear it. I've got this thing that it was like, it was in there and it was suction cup to my window. And you can hear me going, and I'm pulling it off. This is the exact, the exact thing that I pulled off. And I don't remember if I pushed record on this or not. I might have an entire second view of the Parker movie on here, and I don't even know it. How cool would that be? If I do, I'm definitely uploading it. That'd be fun. You get a whole new perspective. Where are we at? Uh, Phoenix Dev says hi. Uh, Coloring gave me many nightmares. Sorry to hear that. 
I love Coraline. My daughter hates it, but I guess as an adult, we see how sinister the movie really is. Oh, Caroline. Coral, wait, C-O-R-A-L. See, Coraline? 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 I'm, I'm not familiar with that. I don't know what that is. I'm sorry. Do you watch soccer? And if you do, what team do you support? I don't really watch it. I played soccer in high school. I, I loved it. It was fun. The what movie? The Parker movie, Sasha. Uh, thank you for your advice. Hi, hi, hi. From Steve Thai food. Watched the movie yesterday. Cool. That was from Summer Rain X. Camaro lover. Hello, new viewer. Cheesy Raccoon. Cool. I just got a dollar thumbs up or super chat from Cheesy Raccoon. How did in the world did you get? I, w I always wondered how do we, how do people come up with names like Cheesy Raccoon? Yeah, I told you how I came up with Crank My Cat. How did you come up with Cheesy Raccoon? Um, Saint Johnsbury, Vermont. I've never been to Vermont. I'd like to though. Fat Cat NWO. This channel can be your way of helping people. The family crap court put you through hell. Like most who divorce, it's a family thing, not a public thing. Yeah, well, I had to make mine public, but I didn't know. I was, I was at my wit's end. I didn't know what else to do. Hello, please notice me. The real B. B. <laughs> How do you say your name? B I H H H. How's life been treating you, Caleb? Jay Meets. I'm doing well. I'm enjoying life. Coraline is how you pronounce it. Coraline. I've, I've never heard of it. Black Hole. You live in Odessa? Oh my goodness. I'm so sorry. That is where I moved from. You have a favorite color? Probably black. Who is you? Logan Mobley. Who is you? Who is I? Tammy Tony. Ah, oh, there's Tammy. Hi, Tammy. Tammy is another one of my Facebook friends. We've just been Facebook friends for so long, I don't even remember not being her Facebook friend. James Floyd in Lindenville, Vermont. One of these days I'll get up to Vermont. I'd love to see it. Y'all are about to start having some really pretty fall leaves, aren't you? How are you doing with COVID? I, I don't wear a mask, I can tell you that much. I'm from Wisconsin and love cheese and raccoons are just cool. <laughs> okay, fair enough. That was from Cheesy Raccoon. Uh, I got my name because I'm epic and my name is Michael and I have the num 147. Okay, you are go be epic. That's awesome. 69 people in here. LOL. R, R, R. Well, now there's 74. Coraline is a movie about a little girl whose parents ignore her, so she wishes for a better parent. And she finds them in a walk of her room, but the other mother is a creepy witch who steals kids' soul. Oh, is this like made like Coraline like years and years ago? The little little brown headed girl? Is that uh, I, okay, Layla W? Hey, I love your channel. I think I could get a shout out. VLK Ice. Out. Yes, I just shouted you out. What is a silver play button from YouTube? Red Dragon. Well, you're new. And so this, I just opened up. I've got my silver play button with my name on it. And it's a, just a plaque congratulating me for getting 100,000 subscribers, which I got about two, two and a half years ago. Parker and I actually made a video that day. Hey, Fat Cat NWO, $25. You're doing the right thing, Caleb. Well, thank you very much. I hope I am. So yeah, I got my, uh, got my, my, my plaque here. And as I pointed out earlier, if you're just joining, it's got a little dent there and it's in the box and I might have to get onto YouTube for it, but it's probably not their fault. It was probably shipped that way because the box itself is dented. I'm really not sure. Oh, Viper Z M S O. What's up, Caleb? Someone match me. <laughs> Thanks. I feel, 
don't know how I should feel about that. Thank you, though, NWO, Cat Big Fat, Fat Cat NWO. Not sure if this is allowed, but did, yeah, that's not allowed. But don't get on to Brad. Uh, he's asking that I, I can't talk about that. Um, I know people have that question, but I don't think it's fair if I talk about that's just not fair and I'm not going to do it. So uh, let's get a $50 chat. Epic M147. Okay. I just showed my dad your videos with your kids and he's going to subscribe to you to show his support. You're an awesome dad. Keep up the great work from the dead eggs. Well, thank you. I actually get a lot of that and I, I appreciate that. What a lot of kids do is they find my channel first and they watch most of the, especially the big ones. And if mom and dad are arguing, fighting, what kids have told me they do, they share like Parker versus the man with one or both of their parents saying, basically, will y'all stop fighting because this is how I feel. And um, I wish I was older so I can get a job and donate $100, but I can do... Oh, black hole! If you, if you keep you, that's very sweet of you. Thank you, thank you. But you, you're young and you're broke, and I've said it a million times. If you're broke, do not send me a dime because I've been there. Logan Mobley, how long did it take for 100,000 subs? I got a hundred thousand uh, back in 2018, so 15, about five years, I guess. But then. It's only been two and a half more years, and I've got three times that many now. So I don't, I don't know what the algorithms are. <laughs> Fat cat, whoa, he's there, man. Thanks, but I'll match me. <laughs> I appreciate that, but you don't have to do that. That's very kind of you, though. Thank you. Do you know memes, OWO? I guess not. Uh, Herbert Alessio, Alessio. Going to bed, but love the channel, and we'll be on for the next live. George Hargreaves. George, have a good evening. Thank you for tuning in. Fear KO. Caleb, do black lives matter? Well, of course they do. Why would you, why would you ask such a thing? Camara Lover, $50 what? Tammy Tony, just think the fat cat NWO. Trixie Pup. Hi, Caleb. Uh, excuse me, but all lives matter. They certainly do, but... That's not. That's exactly why I'm not talking about that because I'm not going in to get baited into where we're talking about things that divide us. Because I'm going to talk about things that bring us together. That's exactly why I'm not getting into that. Thank you for pointing that out, Caleb. Are you religious? Is it okay if I pray for you? Sending love. I'm no from RR. I'm no longer religious. Um, I'm spiritual at best. I, I was raised in a Baptist family for 30 something years but I all I, I don't I don't know why like agnostics such as myself they say that people praying bugs them I don't know I know, I'm all, if you want to pray for me I think that's very very sweet of you thank you for that Caleb I'm so happy for you and how is your kids doing they're doing well but we're not going to talk about that I see you saying all lives matter. Okay, not okay. Let's just chill, chill, chill. <sighs> Calm your jets. That's that's if you're gonna get pissed off in my comment section. I am praying. I'm zooming. I'm Harry Potter zapping. Drive your anger towards the 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 crooked family court system. Drive your anger towards that douchebag Attorney General of Texas, Ken Paxton. I don't, I just, I'd rather not get into those divisive topics. Uh, Luke Fest, not talking about that. Thank you. Fear no, see, exactly, I'm not talking about that. Uh, question HQ, not talking about that. Why are you asking the same questions? Because they're either trolling or they're ignorant. Okay, yes, read what Miss Mary is saying. Okay, Sasha, it's okay. Not not mad, not mad. I, I get it. It's it's chat and there's delays. I know there's like a 20 second delay and I'm not mad. I'm not mad. I'm really not. Um, I like your beard and mustache from Lil Hashi. I, I actually don't. I hate it. It's it just, I'm just lazy. I hate shaving. I hate beards, but I hate shaving. I just hate everything. Just kidding. Talk about the family. Okay, let's talk about family. Yeah, let's see. Let's all be respectful. Our arm. 
You already said the kids are doing good, so stop asking the same crap. <laughs> well, Tammy, some people like jump on late and they don't know. And all YouTube 100,000 plaques matter. Well, mine does to me. Hello, everyone. Honestly, guys, you're a great man. Do you have any advice I need? I'm looking to buy a car. Pay cash for it. Don't borrow money. I stole that from Dave Ramsey. Stole it fair and square. People like their privacy. Okay. Looks like a huge cigar instead of a wand. No. Look, it's, well, I mean, the that end's kind of thick, but look, that end's like tiny. Smaller than my pinky. I mean, I got big fat fingers, but still. Uh, Becca, who's one of the moderators, one of the Whomping Willows, she's the one that sent that to me. It was in a box, and they're not labeled. And you could get Harry Potters, you could get Ron's or Hermione's or Dumbledore's or I guess even Voldemort's, but they're not labeled. And mine came out as the actual wand of Harry Potter. Or it said it was the wand. I've watched, I've like literally paused some of the Harry Potter ones. I don't remember seeing all this on Harry's wand, so... Anyway, it's just fake plastic crap anyways, but it's kind of a fun little fun little prop to play with. I like it. Uh, what have you been up to? I hear, happy to hear from you. I've been just, I've binge watching Harry Potter with the boys. They had never watched it all the way through. What colors have happiness when you survive what you've been through? What colors, what colors has happiness when you survive what you've been through? I'm not quite sure I understand that question. Um, I'm glad I survived. I'm glad it's over with. Let's talk about chicken wings. I can talk about chicken wings. That's fine. Ron's wand is weak. Stop, 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 stop. <laughs> Flax is on the steering wheel. My wand. Look at my wand. Harry said, just be thankful it's not your neck. Alex Plant, congratulations on the button. Thank you. Is Miss Mary part of your family? Nope, but she might as well be. I think that that highly of her. Do I have a favorite color? It's probably black. That's an interesting subject. Okay, let's go down at the bottom. Just weird. No, I'm just a moderator. I'm his friend as well. Yes. The dead eggs, LMAO, I'm cracking up. What is this chat talking about? Chicken wings and Harry Potter. Man, I can bring Harry Potter, I can make a reference of Harry Potter to just about any topic you could probably throw at me. Uh, some moderator put me on timeout for nothing. Oops, sorry about that. I'm sure it was a mistake. I like the signs on your wall. Yep, I've talked about that. And this will be on my channel um, once I'm done within, I don't know, an hour or so. 15 minutes. But the U.S. Army, congratulate your button, or at least some of us in the company. Brian Hooks. All right, cool, thanks. Don't let... Don't bet against the mouse. One of these days, I'm going to be a big boy and have a real computer with a real mouse so I'm not, like, jiggling the phone around. And y'all can actually hear me. I don't have to yell. Ever seen Treasure Planet? It has a wonderful father-son dynamic. Favorite Disney film from the Foxy Pal? No, I've not. I'll, I'll look that up. Caleb, is, I'd like to thank you for doing what you do. Simple, entertaining, you incredible person, been watching you for three years now and started watching you when I was 14. You've helped me become closer with my dad. Awesome, RR, cool. I'm glad to hear that. Shout out to your dad. What's my favorite chicken wing flavor? I, I don't know, I don't really eat chicken wings very often. Porque, porque nadie está hablando español. Are you asking me to please 
something in Spanish? I can read a little bit. I understand a little bit of Spanish. Not very much. Uh oh, somebody said, oh, somebody sent me four pounds. So somebody is in the UK. And they, and they, oh, there it is. Okay. IH Music 55. Hey, Caleb, as a 16 year old with a divorced family, what's the best way to express my emotions to my dad about how I feel about living away from him? Wow, that's a that's a hard question. Um, let me reread that. Hey, Caleb, as a 16 year old with a divorced family, what's the best way to express my emotions to my dad about how I feel living away from him? Um, I've got to, I have to have a little bit more context. I've always made it very, very clear to my kids, even though they don't always do it, they have made it very clear they can always feel free to express whatever it is they're feeling about me or anything for that matter, even if they think it might upset me. But as far as, um, the best way for you to express it, um, just tell them, dad, I love you. And you know, I'm, I'm not sure exactly what you're going for, but I know divorce is hard on kids. One thing I used to tell my kids is they, they would think that they're weird because their parents are getting divorced and is bad as it sounds, I, I always, I, I'd always remind them, I said, really, kids, you're not that, it's actually pretty common. You're not the only ones that go through it. And as bad as it sucks, just know that a lot, about one out of two people you know at your age is going through the same thing, or something similar anyways. But, uh, you know, good question, IH Music 55, tell him, man, give him a big hug. If, send him the, the Parker movies. Why, ask him if he'll watch them with you or, or to your mom. Or, I don't know, obviously, I don't know your dynamic relationship with them, but watch watch some of our bigger movies with your dad. And just or uh, or here's another one. If you don't want to have that kind of time, send him the uh, watch the uh, the one where I pick up my kids uh, reunited after sixty days in jail. It's that was the greatest hug I ever got from my daughter. To this day, that was the best hug ever. I still feel that hug. Mm, Sassy Queenie says she's behaving. Chick-fil-A or Popeyes? I, I guess Popeyes, just because they let me, they let me record from their their parking lot for the first two weeks I was doing this. Oh, did you hear that? He brings sons and fathers together. Brian Hooks. Quieres un helado? Helado. I think you're asking me a question. Where is the... I don't know what helado means. Are you stoned? No. I kind of wish I was, though. Miss Mary Good. I said, why is why is no one speaking Spanish? From Her, Herbert Alessio. Why is no one speaking Spanish? Um, I don't speak very good Spanish. So, I... Um, why would I speak a language that I don't like? Harry Potter says, how can I speak a language I don't even know how to speak? Hello, I just saw your video when Parker didn't want to go back home with his mom. Okay, thanks, Sunset Girl. Chicken-like wings. Tree XA. Hey, Caleb. Miss Mary, how long have you known Caleb? For years and years and years. How did you and Parker get through? Is that's a hard place? To, wait, how did you and Parker get there? Is Bradley surface? I, I, is that is that hard place seven years ago? Uh, dude, you're gonna have to you're gonna have to. Grammar is very important. I, I, I don't understand the question, so I can't answer it. How do you... Okay. Can I see the play button? I can't hear too late. Yes, Brown Afan. I'll pull it back up for the people who are just joining us. Here is my silver play button. There's the cool reflection y'all can see down the rabbit hole. Got my name on it. And 100,000 subscribers, even though I've now got three times that. I'm happy to have my dented plaque. Yes, the shipping, they dented it. That wasn't me. 
Probably not going to worry about it, though. Thank you. It looks nice. Well, thank you. Uh, Bopi Army. How's Parker doing? Not going to talk about that. Nice. Congrats. The world needs men and fathers like you. Congratulations on the YouTube award from Kathy Granilla. Well, thank you, Kathy. Can I see the play button? Okay, I already got... Oh, shit. i got to catch up. Yeah, how's Parker doing? I've already talked about that, Haley. I'm just not gonna, just not gonna, every live I do, and I get asked that same question a thousand times, I'm just not gonna, I can't spend my time going over and over and over and over and over and over and over every time that question's asked. I appreciate the question, I'm just not talking about it anymore. I was just watching the video with your son. Is he yours? I've got three sons, yes. The denting adds character. That's right. I'm sure that you feel dented in some ways. Actually, how dude. That's a quote from, uh, what's that movie? Tombstone. And it's added so much character and resilience to your life. That's, there, there you go. There, exactly. That's how I, that, I like looking at life like that. Like, some people get pissed that it's dented. And I thought, well, oh, but you know what? My life is dented. It, it's perfect. Can I borrow the stop sign? I have personal needs. TWD helper. Not sure I can help you with that. Can you please wish me, wish my, me, my mom and sister good luck? I had an abusive dad and he left, so it's so hard to get a divorce, and you have always been a role model for me in life. Humongous. Well, just, well, thank you for that. It sucks, but it, it, it makes tough people. What's your favorite thing to do right now? Are you a gamer or no? I am not a gamer. Kids are huge gamers, but I just, I the best I can do in gaming is I can save the princess better than any of my kids in the original Super Mario Brothers. Yes, Parker's great. Haley Iverson, goodbye. Thank you for tuning in. Have you read the Harry Potter books or do you just watch the movies? I've read the first four and a half books. I've not read the last two books. And honestly, I think I'm procrastinating because I know once I read them, it's over. The magic is total. I'll never get that feeling again. So I'm secretly like holding off. When I was watching the video with Parker, I started to cry. Me too. That makes about 10 million of us. Lawyers say the relationship between separated parents gets better with time. What's your experience in this regards? Um, I can't talk about my personal relationship with any more than I've already talked about it. I do know people who are better friends afterwards and they they can co-parent very well and I think that should be the goal and um, I like hearing those stories from people and they, they reach out and tell me that you know me and the ex made a kid together we couldn't stand being married but we we really good friends we are maybe not great friends necessarily but we get along really well to help uh, for the betterment of our child I think it's great I think I will be showing your videos to my dad because I'm always trying to improve my relationship with my dad. Uh, IH Music 55. Good deal, man. Get, have at it. Yeah, get, do it. And it can't hurt. Our politics don't match, but I still have much respect for you as a father. Good job. AB. Well, thanks. That's exactly why I don't really want to talk about politics because I've got friends on every side of the political aisle. I'm not left or right. I'm just straight up anarchist. But, but, you know, you say that word, the A word, and people go batshit crazy because of how the media portrays it. Is Parker a gamer? No, he's not. Haley Everson, thanks for stopping by. Oh, that's for Miss Mary. Read the books. They're awesome. They're better than the movies. Agreed. I agree. The, the, the first five books that I have, or four and a half that I've read, by far, yeah, way better than the movies. The movies are great. Okay, not going to talk about that. I laugh because I love the game SMB. SMB, Tammy? I don't know what SMB is. Harry Potter. My 
sister's room is theme is Harry Potter. You'd love it. <laughs> I love being a nerd. A 43-year-old nerd. Do you ever watch? All right. Kinley, I'm not going to give you the pleasure of saying your entire name, but uh, Whomping Willows, find this Kinley person and whack! No second chances for you. Not putting up with that bullshit. So who likes homemade pizza? Co-parenting is very important for my fund. It sure is. Michaela, okay, do you know why you don't live with... I'm not sure what that question is, but I'm not talking about any of that stuff. Like, not talking about that. It's inappropriate for me to talk about anything having to do with my kids and the relationship with anyone else. It's just inappropriate. I don't understand why people do it. I know a lot of people do talk about it, and I wish they wouldn't. I understand that they're frustrated, and they, they want to say certain things, but I think it's completely inappropriate for me to talk about stuff like that. If y'all want to talk about your relationship with you know, from your personal point of view, that's fine. But I'm not going to talk about my own kids and, you know, from a, a third person point of view or whatever you call it. I'm just not going to do it. My relationship with my mom was fixed since I watched the Parker series. It helped me to be able to express myself to my mom as well. And now we're all happy again from Trixay. Nice. Yes. Chalk it up for another good, another good review or a good Something good, positive came out. I love to hearing that. That is why I keep my channel up. It feels so good to talk to someone. It sure does, yeah. That's part of the reason I, I do this. I never thought I'd be the type of person that just get on here and read comments and talk to people, but people like to do it, and I'm having fun. Especially when I get to talk about Harry Potter this and Harry Potter that. Everyone, yes, Miss Mary's asking, answering that dying question, that dire question. Political, oh God, flashbacks are starting to get thrown in my face. Brian Hooks, I'm not sure what that means. I've researched anarchists, whichever, whenever I hear a normal person talking about anarchists, it brings me back to Princess Bride. I think you're using that word wrong. Or uh, how, how's it go? I don't think it means what you think it means. It voluntarist. If I'm ever going to talk in this setting, I usually just say, I shouldn't have said the A word, a voluntarist. A voluntarist is simply someone who thinks that all human interactions should be voluntary. Because if they're not, that means they're coerced or forced. And the initiation of force is always immoral. You prefer cats or dogs? Well, that's an unfair question. I love both. I love cats and I love dogs. How could anybody pick in between? <laughs> Thank you so much for your videos. I don't think you realize how much of a change you're making. You monk, um, well, you're welcome. I, I hear that a lot. I'd like to think that. And when I hear stories, like somebody just commented that, that they're, them and the relationship with their mom is doing so much better after watching it. I love it. I absolutely love it. River X30. Man, just watched that video about your boy. Damn. Which video are you talking about? Because I've got several of them. Yeah. I think Microsoft bought it. Not sure what you're talking about, Sasha. Well, it's a common instinct. We like to talk, and we are meant to communicate with a person like you who listens to people. You're very good. Online friend. Too well. Talk to. Well, thanks, Brian. Dwayne's got to run. I'll ping you later. Walk you through how to stop the phone calls. Thanks, Dwayne. Thank you, thank you, thank you. If you're not subscribed to DSD, he does a hell of a lot better job talking about specific I'd say specific issues that a lot better than I do. He doesn't get sidetracked with Harry Potter and <laughs> stop signs and uh, I don't know, just the crap that I get sidetracked. Mm, but he wants to get it banned, the TikTok. Huh? 
Not sure what that means. Did TikTok get banned? I heard him talk about it. Caleb, is that a tattoo on your arm? And if so, what is it? Uh, Huga. Yes. That's about as political as I'm getting. That is my Ron Paul Love Illusion tattoo. I was a huge Ron Paul. Well, I still am a huge Ron Paul fan, but he ran for president back in 2012. He's the only hardcore presidential candidate I ever really got behind. Bye. I need to finish this animation I'm working on. Herbert Alicio. Cool. Maybe you can show, us, show it off sometime. I'd like to see it. You are the best dad anyone could ask for. Ayusha Nagrani. I don't know about that, but that's very kind of you. Thank you. But now that Microsoft bought it, he doesn't have to. What else? Oh, TikTok. Bye. Because TikTok, it's a dumb account. I personally kind of like TikTok. They're personally responsible for like the last 40,000 subscribers I've gotten this month. <laughs> Ron Paul is my president. <gasps> oh, yeah, that's Miss Mary. I knew she would say that. Trump, not Trinity. Okay, yeah. TikTok is banned from all federal devices, so the government officials can't have TikTok. I don't really care. Just saw that you're online. Wanted to say, do a drive-by and see that you're doing well. Your eyes and smile are great. Gorgeous. You must be seven. But you knew that stay wonderful well thank you hey i did get a haircut today finally it's been like three or four months I had my covid haircut i was getting all shaggy looking like my father you should run for president or mayor no way man i do not want that headache caleb you are you my i don't know what that means caleb are you my ni my nine I don't know what that means, I, so I can't answer that, Ohuga. What's your TikTok, Caleb? I don't have one. I, I downloaded the app only because people kept tagging me saying, hey, I saw you on TikTok, saw you on TikTok, saw you on TikTok. So I, I downloaded the app just so I could go watch it. People were getting my old, old, old videos and putting them up. But uh, I, I I don't have a TikTok. Uh, it's, it's kind of a... It's just, I guess a generational thing. Um, hey, Caleb, do you have any other social medias? Yes. I'm starting to get slowly but surely get away from Facebook because I'm so sick of it. It's such a fucking cesspool. Um, I'm on my, on my Instagram, at Caleb Everett. I'm on Twitter, at Caleb Everett. I'm on some of the other alt medias like, uh, oh, Minds. But I, hardly, I don't remember to get on them very often. But for some reason, my a lot of people have started following me on Twitter. Like, I don't, I still don't understand Twitter. I'm trying to understand it, but I still don't. Congratulations. Keep up the good work. Hope you get recommended. William Bogie. Yeah, so if you're just joining, this is my uh, plaque for my uh, silver plaque, silver play button. I'm kind of excited about it. I need your stop sign for my bedroom doors, just to remind my parents where they can go and where they can't. <laughs> Y'all are funny. Okay, thank you, Miss Mary. Congratulations. All right, well, kids, we are over an hour into this, and I'm kind of getting tired. And thank you for everybody, especially Fat Cat NWO for donating, and somebody else was in there. But I can't remember who it was, but if you would like, you need a techie in your life. Yeah, I do. I, um, I do. I wish I, I wish my other half, if I had one, would be that type of person, but unfortunately, I just don't have that person. So anyways, I'm going to get off here, and um, I don't know when I'm going to go live again. I guess uh, probably, I guess, Sunday again. Okay, Munchie says, wait, Caleb. Well, Munchie, what am I waiting for? We got to go for the gold play button next. Heck yeah. I'm a third of the way there. Just 640,000 more subscribers to go. A good, good night. Thank you. I've got a food question. All right, Munchie, I'll do one more. Bye, Tammy. Thanks so much. Um, I'm 
been waiting on Munchie. One, I'll do one last question. If you can get it to me in time, stay safe. Sending good vibes to you and your kids from Kathy Granillo. Thank you very much. I've been subbed since day one. William Bogey. Thank you very much. You're one of the one of the OGs. Dad Gummit, somebody just sent me twenty bucks. Who was that? Christian Blanco. Have a good night. Well, Christian, thank you very much for that. I do appreciate it. Miss Mary, whoa. I wouldn't go pissing Miss Mary off. Oh, YouTube is so dumb. Okay, okay, yeah, sorry. I, sorry, 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 sorry. YouTube, yeah. Yeah, sometimes they do dumb things, but uh, again, Christian Blanco, thank you again for that. I do appreciate it. Um... Bye, Caleb. Thank you. Munchie, I don't know where you went. I was going to answer that last question, but I didn't see it. Maybe I missed it. Uh, oh, what are you allergic to? And two hats, what's your favorite food? I'm not allergic to anything except the family court. They make me sick and vomit. And my favorite food is sushi or Mexican. By far. Oops. My head hurts. Okay, um... Uh, what are y'all laughing at? I'm not really sure. Maybe I'm a, I'm a comedian. I didn't know it. All right. Love y'all. Thanks for again. I'll be on Sunday. I don't know if I'll do seven. If you want the only... Okay, y'all. Yeah. If you want to know when I'm going live, go to my... If you go to my homepage, go to the community section. If I'm going to update it anywhere... I'm not going to put it on any other social media. It'll only be on my community section. I'll be going live on such and such date at such and such a time. So you can either click the little bell and that'll give you the notification. Or if you're just curious, as soon as I know I'm going to go live at a particular time, it'll be in the community section. So anyway, bye y'all. Thanks so much. Thanks for your, 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 chip and your tips in there. I do really appreciate it. Bye. Long live Harry Potter.